Johnny momentum continues. Uh, uh, another victory, an eleventh game unbeaten. Seemed like a pleasing performance tonight. How how did you see it? Is this where I'm supposed to smile again? Uh, I, I wish I could enjoy the game, but you know, because you're so emotionally involved. But when I reflect on that, when I watch it again, I will enjoy it. Um, first half, the first 15 20 minutes, we, we would go on the front foot, we, we pressed them, scored a good goal. And then I've got to take my hat off the game, they took the game to us then, they pinned us back, um, they wrestled control of the game off us, to be honest. And they're a good side, you know, they're above us in the league for a reason. And, um, and they did cause us problems, um, but we did defend well, you know, we had to defend a lot of corners, a lot of set plays into our box. And we did defend them well. Um, and then we went out to totally different animals second half we, we had some words with the players about about we, we have to be better on the ball we have to be better in possession in their half and if we're going to counter we have to counter with a purpose thankfully we got the goal early on in the second half and then they naturally had to commit more men forward um, and every team in the world goes more direct when they're getting beat 2-0 um, now in the past we probably sat in too deep and your heart's in your mouth and eventually you, you concede and then the momentum's with the opposition, i.e. the Morecambe game. Well today the difference was we, we got the ball down and passed it and we passed it out and therefore we could create chances. So we had big spells in there off which relieved the pressure off our, off our defence. And I did think we defended really well but that's a classic counter attack and performance and some of the football we played in the second half I think there was one where Sean's come into far post and smashed it over the bar and if that goes in it's you're talking about in the same breath as Carlos Alberto who's going for Brazil in the 70 World Cup you know we've played some beautiful one touch football uh, great to see the players playing with confidence and you know we want to try and keep this run going and, and see where it takes us Was that one of those nights that you've talked about for years where you can't mark anybody Below seven out of ten, where it's a, a proper team display. I think you find it difficult to mark anyone below eight, to be honest. Um, and there was a couple of tens in there for sure. Um, and it's pleasing when you do it against a good side. You know, it's all, all well and good um, doing it when it doesn't matter. But they're a, they're, a, they're a good side, Cambridge. And they'll win a lot of games between now and the end of the season. Uh, so to be able to counter the way we did in the second half, and I know that they have to commit men forward and I get all that um, but you've still got to exploit that space and we did it really really well tonight I've been resisting this one for a few weeks but I'm going to say it can I congratulate you on staying up 50 points I just swept set of the players there I think that, that should be us safe but you know now that, that's one uh, goal ticked off but we we want to definitely try and finish in the top half that's a, a major objective for us we think we're good enough to do that and then you never know if you could finish like a train the last seven games and you could win them um, or win six of them you might have a chance of sneaking in the playoffs you know it's a big ask but it's not impossible from where you were at Christmas it's worlds away isn't it to be talking about top half and playoffs it is and you know if you're not careful you'd you'd beat yourself up over the points that were thrown away throughout the season and we've lost to no disrespect but we've lost to far worse teams than Cambridge um, without playing much different to be honest the big change is scoring goals you know score goals at any level take pressure off your, t off your whole team particularly your defence and we feel as though we've got goals all over the park now um, Matty's dried up Sean and Shane McCartan start kicking up and you know yeah, it's a terrific return for Shane McCartan you know I think he scored his first goal in February and he's on nine now so um, that's a good, good boost for him and he's playing with bags of confidence in. quiet in the first half but second half he was unplayable 